Hey guys, so up today on Gear Experiments, we're going to demo two different kayaks that look almost exactly the same and they're priced about the same too. And the first is this K2 Sierra model and this is a two-man inflatable kayak. But also there's this K2 Explorer model, two-man uh, inflatable kayak. And, and if you look at the specs on these things, you know, they both handle 400 pounds and 400 pounds. So my guess is that they might be the exact same thing in different packaging. Who knows? Maybe they are different, but we'll give it a shot. Uh, you can get the Sierra model for slightly cheaper, usually maybe around $20 cheaper or something like that. But anyways, I got them both today, and we're going to see if there's any difference. So let's check it out. All right, so let's unbox this. The, the logo is definitely different on them. Right, the, the cosmetics are different, but let's see if that's the only difference. All right, that comes in the K2 out of the Sierra. And that is for the Explorer model. So off the bat, they look the same. I think the boxes are the same size. Yeah, the boxes are the same size too. So let's continue and keep this here for reference. Now we already know that cosmetics are different. Boat, seats, fin, paddles, and pump. So let's look at the pump that it comes with. So there's this handheld pump. It's lightweight. It doesn't look real durable, but I'm sure it gets the job done. So let's try the Explorer model. My guess is that it's going to look exactly the same with different prints. look at the two pumps so they're indeed the same pump throw that out seats seats look the same things look the same let's check out the oars These oars, and to me, they feel and look the same also. So, we will give them a shot. Materials feel pretty much the same. So before blowing it up, I feel like the Explorer might be at two inches longer maybe, but we'll see. We'll pump it up and see. So Which I think up here is the, the two two of the chambers. I got my buddy here helping me out. We'll let that cook for a while. After you pump it up, you just screw this in tight to seal it up. So let's pump up the rest of it. 
All right, we almost have it filled up. And we I think we're supposed to do the floors first. We'll know better for the next one. But we're almost there. All right, so we got them both pumped up in. You know, honestly, quality-wise, they feel the same to me. They're not exactly the same at minus cosmetics because if you look in here, the the pump up valves are on this side, and for this Sierra bottle, the valves are on this side. So that's actually the only thing I could see that's different. So let's take a look at it from the top view. It seems pretty much the same to me. I, I don't know anything that's actually different other than the valve location. So let's put in the chairs and jump in. Okay, so another slight difference is there's more color difference. Uh, the Explorer has a dark side and a light side and the Sierra is just light on both sides. I don't think that makes any difference. Um, the chairs themselves look the same. They're the same shape, same size. All right, let's throw it in. All right, let's sit, let's see how, um, I'm a buck 75, five eight with shoes on. Seems okay. I don't know how it's going to be in the water, but. <coughs> Feels the same. I don't, they don't feel any different when I sit in them. But uh, the big test is that we're going to be taking this out on a small lake and we're going to see how they perform. And if we come back alive, that's a good thing. So we'll see you at the campsite. All right, getting the kayaks ready here at Lake Diaz. We're going in there. Okay, so after we're pumping up the K2 a little bit tighter, the K2 Explorer, I think it's a little bit thicker. It pumps up a little bit thicker than the Sierra does. So maybe that's the difference. That's pushing the weight limits right there. 160 plus 240, 400 total. It was a success. I think it was a success. Both boats, Albert. Quicker at deflating. Okay, one thing, it seems the buckles on the Sierra model is tighter and not as smooth as the Explorer model. So really, I feel like the Explorer pumps up a little bit fatter and the buckles are better. So that's the way to go if they're about the same price.